Hey guys, it's Nick from Bonsai.com, and today I am talking about the bonsai oak tree. So, bonsai that are most popular tend to be juniper or conifer, but another great option available is the bonsai oak. This type of bonsai grows in several locations, including North Africa and Europe. The bonsai oak tolerates seasonal temperatures from severely low freezing, yeah, from severely low freezing to mild summers, as well as drought, and for this reason, it is becoming a popular choice with consumers because of its hardiness. So you have different types of bonsai oak. English bonsai oak grows to a nice size, but it's not overly big. Its official name is Quarius rubber, rubber, I can't say that scientific name, and commonly grows in wet soil and is quite deep-rooted. It is mostly found in the Scottish Highlands and southwest England in the UK and grows best from uh, 660 to 1,320 feet above sea level. It usually holds about 280 different life forms within its body. When grown in the wild, it can grow up to 130 feet tall. Some English bonsai oak produce acorn and fruit. So you have some concerns, or rather, hold on, a white bonsai oak can grow up to 100 feet tall and spread up to 80 feet wide. They can be trained into miniature trees, and the leaves have many different colors from gray to pink. In the summer, they are dark green, and in the fall, brown or red. So most bonsai trees need partial shade. They prefer wet soil, but will survive and do well in moist or dry soil. The main goal with bonsai is to keep the soil between 3.7 and 7.3 uh, pH levels. There are several concerns over bonsai oak that may affect a consumer purchase. It is best for people to be aware of these before they decide, decide to invest in one. Bons bonsai oak is more susceptible to insects and diseases than many other trees, with white oak being the worst. Insects are, co are common on a lot of trees but with diseases, it can affect the appearance of the tree and its general care. Bonsai oak are also susceptible to oak scale and in the summer seasons can often develop mildew on their bark. However, despite these concerns, most bonsai providing, uh, providing that they have good care and are planted in good soil and watered regularly uh, with sunlight, will grow to look great and provide years of enjoyment for their owners as well as being a great pleasing addition for a garden so that's all for this video if you're interested in learning how to trim sculpt and prune your bonsai then check out my book bonsai tree at bonbonsai.com forward slash bonsai book now i'm gonna be making more videos than i already have so stay tuned subscribe and i'll see you in the next one